When we led the Safaricom 2.0 transformation, we made sure that society received due recognition as a key partner in our ecosystem. Our society charter states that we will work closely with Kenyans to be a respected and empowering contributor to society. Now, while we participate as an integral part of this process in uplifting society, our relationship will be built on the principles of partnership, humility, openness, and professionalism. Now, the Safaricom Foundation extends our work, our commitments, and our partnerships beyond our telecommunications network and strengthens our links to communities countrywide. Now, I'm genuinely pleased to see the ingenuity of Kenyans and the ways in which they apply the Safaricom Foundation's funding to address the needs in health, in education, economic empowerment, water, and many other focus areas of the Foundation. I enjoy visiting projects, and this year I visited the Sabatia Eye Hospital, where we supported the construction of a specialized eye unit. I visited Zabibu Home, which provides um, support and care for children from you know, vulnerable circumstances. And I visited the medical camp in Pokot, where over 3,000 people receive specialized health care. I'm also incidentally volunteering my time to support the Diabetes Management and Information Centre as, you know, my World of Difference project. So in July 2011, the Safaricom Foundation partnered with the Kenya Red Cross and the KCB Foundation, as well as the Media Owners Association, on the Kenyans for Kenya initiative. Now, you know, in just four weeks, we ignited the spirit of giving amongst Kenyans and raised an unprecedented 677 million shillings in cash and close to 300 million in kind. It was great to see the delivery of emergency food and water, but I look forward most to seeing the outcome of the longer term integrated water, agriculture and health projects in Takana, in Pokot and indeed in Moyali. Uh, these projects will demonstrate real and sustainable change. I'm most proud of the fact that millions of Kenya contributed towards the cause and that they contribute to keep the cause of Kenyans supporting our fellow Kenyans alive. And I'd like to see the Foundation continue to drive similar initiatives where relevant. Uh, when we partner, we can actually achieve a lot more. Uh, the use of technology for the development solution is changing the way health, education and economic empowerment is delivered to communities. The Foundation has a portfolio which we call Mobiles for Good and I believe that this will be an exciting growth area for the Foundation. And finally, after nine years, the Farrakhan Foundation is well positioned to shape and to influence the corporate social investment agenda in Kenya. The Foundation can do more around addressing economic empowerment and sustainability. Our research shows that Kenyans value the opportunity to generate income and then to use that income to address the health and education needs. And we want to be a catalyst for empowerment in Kenyans. I'd also like to hear more about the success of our projects and the impact that they have on families and communities. So to our partners, you know, please let me know how you are changing Kenyans for the better. We welcome the opportunity to visit your projects and to see some of your achievements.